Tonight, we hear from the woman who found a four-year-old girl wandering along New Road on Monday morning alone. Her name is Estella Reinhardt. She found the girl and then helped police find her mom. First News reporter Lindsay Watson joins us live in the studio. It's a story you'll only see on 27. And while she's not condoning the incident that led up to her finding the little girl walking alone along New Road in Austin Town, Estella says she understands both sides of the situation and ultimately feels for the mother at the center of this investigation. It was just another Monday morning for Estella Reinhardt. Went to the bank, stopped at the gas station on New Road, drove down towards the apartments. When it turned out to be anything but. And it was a little girl running, not on the road, but next to it, and it didn't look right. While driving down New Road with her father around 1030, she saw the girl with no shoes or jacket. Then her motherly instincts kicked in. Just kind of called her over to me and said, hey, you know, come here, what are you doing? You know, she said she was allowed to be outside and that her mom doesn't mind if she was going to play. Estella says she desperately tried to help the little girl find her house for about 20 minutes. But when she was unable to, she called the police. I wanted to give it the benefit of the doubt, but... I mean, after 20 minutes, it was kind of like, you know, I expected somebody to peek their head out and say, hey, you know, like, where are you at? What are you doing? And nothing. And that was like disturbing. That was upsetting. Officers say this isn't the first time that this has happened with the four year old. About six months ago, the child was outside. The mom was out pretty quick, said she just lost sight of her for a minute. Um, and then one week prior to this time, um, the child was out wandering and it took about 20 minutes to figure out where she lived. But Estella also feels for Kristen Atkins, the mother of the little girl. And it's a terrible thing, something terrible could have happened. But like, let's, we don't know her. We don't know what she's going through. We don't know what she's struggling with. Now 26 year old Kristen Atkins told a judge this morning, just like you saw there, that she didn't put her child in danger and entered a not guilty plea on the child endangering charge. That little girl is now in her grandmother's custody. Reporting live in the studio, Lindsay Watson, 27 First News at 11.